Hello, you're very welcome to the Grimsley Hotel. We call it the home of W.S. Gilbert of Gilbert and Sullivan fame. This is the Rose Garden, Sunken Rose Garden, Lady Gilbert's pride and joy. Uh, Gilbert would go off uh, and travel the world writing his operatus and uh, bring gifts back in the form of buds to his lovely wife. This is Gilbert's croquet lawn. He was much better at it than I am. There's a picture here of Henry Lytton. Henry Lytton was the original rapper and was in most of Gilbert's successful operas. Henry Lytton was to Gilbert what Leonardo DiCaprio is to Martin Scorsese. Gilbert loved animals and uh, his favourite animal was a pet monkey he had. And uh, there's lots of pictures of Gilbert in books with the monkey on his shoulder as if it were a parrot. Um, his pet monkey's name was Paul. And this is Paul's tombstone. And it says, uh, it says Paul on it. And this is Gilbert's bedroom. He slept in it. This is the library where Gilbert wrote three of his operas, Rosenstance and Gilderstern, Grand Duke, which was uh, an opera about sausage rolls. Uh, I think he was running out of ideas then. On May 29th, 1911, uh, Gilbert died. He died at age 74 in this lake. He had a busy day. He was uh, around visiting people in London. He came back here for a 4 p.m. pool party with two actresses. They were swimming in the lake until one of the actresses lost her footing and uh, started to, to call out to Gilbert, help, help. <clears throat> Gilbert swam over uh, to try and save one of the actresses and uh, sank. Gilbert was brought back into the library bar uh, where he was pronounced dead at 4.30 p.m. Lady Gilbert was absolutely heartbroken. 